Now, this is for me, if you ask me, a mega problem of the left. And sorry, give me two minutes. That's my problem with uh, cancel culture. I'm not against it. I mean, against its goals. But you know what happens, what happened to me yesterday, which is cancel culture fights for diversity and inclusion. Perfect. But didn't you notice how there are practically, apart from empty phrases, equality, blah, blah, no positive models. All they do is canceling, and they especially write, write this, like this narcissism of small differences, you know. Like, we are both anti-racism, but I would say, wait a minute, you used an expression which can be understood in a racist way. That's my reproach to cancel culture. It is not a tool to build a larger solidarity. The so-called third world is here much stronger efficient. That's why I admire Iran, not the Ayatollah, but that a big movement after that Kurdish uh, uh, girl was killed. They did something that we in the West obviously are not able. What began as a woman's protest developed into a global protest movement. Ordinary people, even some enlightened Muslims, they all joined. That's what we need today. And uh, uh, this is what the left is supposed to do, but no, the left and even the right now are systematically destroying themselves. Systematically. We, what is now so fashionable? I just, just, um, let me quote. Okay, I will allow this yeah. brutal neo fascist intruder <laughs> to stop me. Okay. Don't you think that this cancel culture is so much penetrated with a spirit of suspicion, distrust, and despair? They cannot formulate a, 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 a project. Adorno said, no, not the dirty thing, said once that the really good film, you know, when there was the time of so-called Hays Code, all censorship prohibitions in Hollywood, worse than in Stalinism that time, he said that a really good film would have obeyed all these prohibitions without being forced to. I would say a really good friendship would use all the vulgarities, but in such a way that it would have been absolutely clear to both sides that they are not meant in that way. And to, sorry, to, to answer to your question, uh, I am not blaming this for the crisis of the left. I am, uh, the causes are deeper, but I rather see cancel culture and so on as a desperate attempt to change the issue. Instead of fighting real radical problems, exploitation of women and all that, slavery even, for example. Do you know how much slavery today still exists? No, we talk, are you he or she or they or whatever. I am for all these things, but it sabotages the real struggle, which must be an encompassing struggle. 